so we have made it to Milwaukee. It is a cloudy, rainy day out here. We're staying at the Trade Hotel downtown Milwaukee. This is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful hotel. So if you're planning on coming over here anytime soon or in the future, check this place out. Absolutely beautiful. We also got this nice little gift set right here. So we got this bag, Harley Davidson bag with the 120 logo. We got some goodies inside as well. So we got this cam cooler, pretty cool. Uh, with that can cooler, you can forget about your root beer. You got an authentic Harley Davidson chapstick. This dope Harley Davidson snapback. We got some genuine Harley Davidson riding comfort socks. The uh, 120th anniversary t-shirt. We have a 120th Harley Davidson bandana. We have a flag as well, 120th anniversary flag. So that's gonna go up in the garage. Super excited for this trip. I have a lot of stuff planned for you guys. Obviously, we're gonna have the new CVO review that's gonna come up. We're gonna have the press launch bike ride as well that's going to come up um there's going to be some content with some other content creators as well um just a lot of footage a lot of video on the 2023 harley davidson cvos obviously that's what we're here for we're also here to celebrate the 120th anniversary so there's gonna be a lot of footage so sit back tune in this video is basically going to be uh, uh snippets of every day while i'm here so i'm going to be here for the next four days you'll see a little bit of everything every day of what we're doing and then throughout the days there's going to be separate videos for that so a lot of content coming your way. We have some nice drinks right here as well. Those are, this is new, nice and bottled up. We got the uh, media passes right here. I gotta say, this has to be one of the nicest rooms, nicest hotels I've stayed at. Just, just look at this, I, I thought this was pretty cool. I'm a little neat freak, so I already got all my stuff sectioned off right there. Got all my t-shirts that I'm gonna be wearing for the next few days. Bottoms, riding jackets, some rain gear, just in case if it is gonna rain tomorrow during the press launch. Got my hats on this side and my helmet. Let's start getting ready in a few minutes because we're gonna have a dinner tonight and um, stop by the, um, the Harley Davidson Museum. So it's gonna be a lot of footage in the Harley Davidson Museum as well, I cannot wait. The Harley Davidson Museum is one of those places that I've always wanted to visit. Um, and I'm, I'm super excited just to see just all the old bikes from all the Harley Davidson history. It's all bottled up all together in one big room. It's just, I can't wait. How many drinks have you had? Uh, <laughs> sitting at the bar for the last like hour. Have you been at the bar for five? Hey man, what's up y'all? This is GQ, go ahead and follow everybody else, but follow me too um, at Just GQ. Where you at it from? New Orleans? New Orleans, Louisiana. You guys brought up here all day, he came in soaked? Soaked, like, like a wet sponge, like, yeah. And then the man, the myth, the legend, the one that make it all happen all the time, <laughs> Matt. One of the people, one of the people. One of them. <laughs> Doesn't work without Jen Yo, Yeah, you shout out to Jen. She, Jen's always in clutch. Yeah. She comes in clutch all the time. She's the master. She is. <laughs> no pressure. Spotted cow. Can, can you only, can you let everybody know that you can only get this beer in Wisconsin? Allegedly or they in told Milwaukee? Me. So, Allegedly. Milwaukee is where Miller Lite is from. I'm a giant fan of Miller Lite. As I ordered a Miller Lite, they were like, no, you gotta get the spotted cow. I'm like, well, baby, don't twist my arm. Give me the spotted cow. So that's what I got. Coronas. Oh, I love For Coronas. Modelos. I love, oh, Modelo. I just bought a t shirt that says Modelo because mm -hmm. I love, yeah, I love Modelo. But I like Corona Premier because they're like. That's strong beer. Which Imported one? beer. Modelo? Modelo, yeah. It's fucking delicious. I, I just saw a documentary on that, so I know. What was it? Fun fact. About, what was this one? Uh, bad. It's a local. Red ale. I, yeah, it's, a, it's, it's like a red ale, like an Irish right. red. Those are my favorite kinds of beers. I can only have a few. Only have a few? You, you're up to like number 22, bro. <laughs> two one of those. Of these? Of these? Yeah. And of those, one. And How many Millers have you had already? At least you lost count. 14. She lost count. <laughs> Tweet team, no alcohol over here. Goddamn fruit punch drinkers. Well, first time impression, just looking at the bike right now. It looks good. It looks really good. I just finished sitting on it right now, and it, it feels so different, and in a good way. 
I'll say that. It just feels really different in a good way. The bags are different. The fairing is different. Even where the controls are right now, everything just feels really good. It feels real premium. feels really Harley Davidson. A lot of more content coming on this brand new CBO, guys. Thursday morning, we are here, my first time ever at the Harley Davidson Museum. Just even the outside of this building is just amazing, man. It looks it's dope. Look at this. So we use a lot of footage from the inside. I'm gonna try to show you guys everything. So we have a sea of all brand new 2023 bikes here in the background. All beautiful, look at this. A sea of 2023 models. This is awesome. Towards the back, we're gonna have the brand new CBO, so we'll take a walk over there, show you guys real quick. Because um, the lights are just, they stand out to me so much from here, just looking at down the hall right there. Look at that. Those lights look so good turned on. Just the lines on the lights, it's just wow. Right, that's something we haven't seen yet. The taller shield on top, it's all clear. Was nice. Have the fully adjustable rear shocks right here, and then the 121 powertrain. I've been so hyped up just to ride the uh, the road glide that I'm like, I'm like, wait a minute, there's there's also a, a brand new street glide as well, and I'm just at awe with the road glide. Everybody knows that road glides are better than street glides. Everybody knows that. Uh, excuse me, sir. Everybody. I'm, I'm sorry, ain't, sir. Ain't, ain't none of I'm sorry. talking about road glides. Uh, we're just talking about road glides right here. <laughs> <laughs> you guys should you be doing? following this guy right here, right? Yeah, hey. The man, Everybody listen. The legend. I do, I, would, I do ride a road glide now, but we know ain't no glide like a street friend. glide. That's all I got to say. <laughs> street glide or no glide. Nah, I'm just kidding. But yeah, man, what do you think about this? It's beautiful, dude. It's yeah. beautiful. No. I've been, uh, I've been, I mean, I got a road glide at home and I'm just, I've been so hyped about the road glide that I'm like, wait a minute. There's also a brand new street glide here too. Yeah. But it looks beautiful. Yeah. The, the, this will go into the future for the next 15 years maybe, man. You guys gotta know is that when, I know from the pictures and the videos, this light looks gigantic, but in person it's not so much. It's, it's a. It looks a bit more reserved when you're looking at it in person, and it's just the cutouts, the lines of the, of where the lights are, are all lined up. That it just it flows perfectly with the fairing, with the bike. All the lines were just really, really thought out. So uh, we're gonna have a great few days of riding together. You're gonna have a lot of cool experiences. I want to introduce a few people, and we're gonna talk a little bit more about what you're seeing here and what you're gonna experience. Yeah, no. Man, I gotta get out of this. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. I don't want to break anything. All right, guys. So we made it to the Iron Horse Hotel. We're gonna have dinner right now. A lot of activity going on here. Guess who we stumbled upon over here, all the way in Milwaukee? You know, I, you know I had to show up for my brother over here, bro. Look, look right here. What's the numbers? Ah! Oh. Yo, Jerry, where you at? Where's the hot dog stand? <laughs> Jerry, follow the wiener. We got the whole Jersey squad here. I walked into the gift shop, I'm like, my friend's in the middle. He goes, I don't care. Salpina said that this bike looks way better than yours, too. It's close, bro. <laughs> Actually, it's a lot better. I didn't want to be a dick. This thing is beautiful, bro. I love your sour. This is fucking beautiful. <laughs> Guys, we are at the V Twin Visionary uh, bike show right now for Bike Night here. Everybody.
Everybody, I'm moving to Tennessee. That's right. <laughs> He'll be my neighbor. I got my He'll neighbor right here. My neighbor back there. That's right. There'll be YouTube sensation. Hey, come down south. We'll do some real southern stuff. Oh, hell yeah. We're going to ride some glides. We're going to eat some good food. And we, the other stuff I can't tell you about. <laughs> good morning, good morning, good morning. It is Saturday. We got the bikes all lined up here. We got the white low rider ST, which I'm going to be riding today again. Um, it is early. I gotta go meet up with Blackhead and her two wheels real quick. We're gonna get some coffee. Um, and what we got planned for today is uh, we have a panel with the CEO at the uh, Harley Museum. And after that, we're gonna do the tour of the actual museum as well, which I'm super excited to do that. The museum tour is gonna be its own video as well. Um, reason why I'm breaking everything up is obviously I wanna focus just on different little things so in case if anyone's just interested in watching one thing you're able to just click that video um but you should be watching all the videos so <laughs> but that would make me uh nice and organized for you guys doing it that way all right this has to be the day that this place has been packed 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 and it's a hot one toasty very toasty but th this guy has gone through four shirts already <laughs> <laughs> twice so eight shirts <laughs> I think these bikes that are displayed here from the 30s probably have to be my favorites in here. This this will be my bike. But once again, the black and red because that's my road glide black and red. I just I love that color combo. Get look at these bikes. I could sit here on this little bench and look at these bikes all day. With that 121 VBT Milwaukee 8 engine, we're talking about 139 foot pounds of torque, 115 horse. Oh, this is some fancy ass bowls. What is this? Yeah, full on pineapple. Chicken pineapple. You guys are so cute. Thank you guys are the cutest couple out here. We try. Besides me and Peanut. You're gonna throw your chopper in the middle. Right outside the Harley Museum. My bike is all the way back there behind that bridge. I'm not walking over there, so uh, we're gonna travel in style. Right on, baby! My body friend! <laughs> right on, baby! He's the gay one! <laughs> yeah! With my Jersey crew, we are heading up to House of Harley Davidson. So my wife was actually supposed to come out here. And uh her flight got canceled twice because we were getting nothing but storms in Jersey. So uh, yeah, that's a bummer, man. She's not really crazy into the whole bike scene, but she was kind of excited uh, for this event, obviously being such a big and important event. Uh, man, it would have just been awesome, man. It would have been great. But we got next year, we got more rallies and um, we'll be doing a lot of more rounds. You'll be seeing more of the Jersey crew roaming out throughout the country next year for sure. Us peasants wait on lines and we, you know, just hang out here. We have a VIP member here who just sits in the office. What are you, the sales manager here? Uh, no, I'm just sitting, I'm just sitting here and just uh, enjoying the air conditioning. <laughs> <laughs> this guy, man, look, he got his own, he got his own office in here. No, no. All right, so we picked up some merch right there. The line was insane. Heading back to the uh, La Para booth. Oh shit, back to back. back to back. What? Who did that? Yo, someone's trying to show you out, bro? Yo, did you see this thing? That's what I'm saying. Two, 200, 227 horsepower. Yo, it is hot today. It is hot as hell. I'm happy I got my merch. We had a good time here. Had a good time at the La Para booth. Saw some good friends. Oh, it's nice to be twinning with somebody. Let me block. 
You're supposed to be just winning with us. Yeah. We're supposed to be. Like, what they give you? Oh, that's my size. Do I look large? Wow, we are so underdressed. Hey, how are you? Oh, of course. Who is that? Wait, uh, are we going in and out? Yeah, we're going to get some drinks and oh, some okay. hors d'oeuvres and then... There we go. I'm so underdressed for this. I feel like I'm at a... This is awesome. <laughs> Dude, you getting hot? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Wait a minute, is that Blockhead? Are you Blockhead? Can you talk? 